Image Copyright Facebook Image Caption Tony Martin was hit by a piece of timber in Wolverhampton during Storm Doris A. Wooden panel which struck and killed a woman during a storm, was blown around like a piece of paper, an inquest has heard. Jurors heard the section of water tank cover hit Tony Martin after falling from the roof of a six-story building during Storm Doris in February. Ms. Martin, 29, from Stafford, died after suffering head injuries near Wolverhampton's Mander Center. One witness said the panel looked rotten, jurors heard. Image copyright family handout image caption Tony Martin was walking with a University of Wolverhampton colleague when she was hit Emma Whitting, assistant coroner for the black country, heard part of the cover landed in Dudley Street. The inquest was told Ms. Martin was killed just weeks after getting engaged. Her fiancé Sean Lee said they were planning a family and she had so much to live for. The University of Wolverhampton employee was walking with her colleague Raymond Sarple, who was knocked to the ground and treated for a leg injury. Image caption inquest jurors heard a witness describe the panel felt like a belief jurors heard a statement given to police by witness Rebecca Cresswell who saw the panel hit the women. I had a clear view, watching it fall from the sky like a leaf, she reports said. It took 10-20 seconds to get from top to bottom. Ms. Martin and Ms. Sarple were discussing. How windy it was when they were knocked to the ground, jurors heard. Image caption One witness told police the timber reminded her of a square dining table. A statement read on behalf of Ms. Sarple said I remember hearing the clatter of something on the floor. My legs were hurting, and I was saying to Tani, I think I can get up. Another witness, Tiffany Whitehall, told police the timber reminded her of a square dining table and said the wood looked rotten. It looked like old wood that had been out in the elements for a long time, her statement said. In another statement, read to the jury, a police forensics investigator observed that the structure housing the panel had screws which appeared badly corroded. The inquest, in Oldbury, is expected to last for up to five days.